What's up, YouTube? My name is the Lazy Tryhard, and today we are going to be uh, learning about a brand new emulator that uh, one of your fellow subscribers showed me and kind of um, asked me about. So, moral here: um, you have your emulator; it takes so long to load, and you don't want to do it. Well, here's some helpful tips from you guys uh, that kind of showed me. Because normally I don't really use an emulator because I have my own uh, Nexus 7, no big deal. Um, but for those of you guys who don't actually have an Android device in which you can develop on, um, I'm going to show you guys two tricks that you guys actually showed me. So I'm just relaying what you guys have already shown me. So uh, this first one comes from Havarha. And basically he says, blah, 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 I've seen your videos and they're so awesome, blah, blah, blah. I know. I know, it's okay. <laughs> anyway, um, so when you start the emulator and it goes really slow, and this is the um, the Eclipse emulator, the emulator that comes with um, any uh, thing that we've already covered. So basically, uh, episode one, when we got all the, um, the Android emulators, these are the emulators he's talking about, how to optimize them. So normally, um, what I would do is I would start one up and... Um, you just go like virtual ma device manager uh, start it so we're gonna start it and it's gonna take forever um, I'm not gonna really wait for this whole thing to boot up but I'm gonna show you this cute little trick or trick that he showed me um, so basically if you open your windows task manager so you go um, right click start task manager you have all these operations right well if you go to um, the processes and you go to image name um, and you find the emulator, which should be um, right there. Uh, if you right-click it and set a firmity, now it's set to one processor. But if you set it to all processors, like he said, uh, it'll go much faster. So that'll hopefully help kind of boot it up and stuff like that, um, make it more responsive. So that's one trick that I have um, been told. So thank you, Havarha, or ha <laughs> Harvard, as you like to go. I almost said Harvard. I don't. I'm not sure. I see that little. Okay. Anyway, thank you so much. Um, so this next one actually comes from Gerald Navin. Thank you so much, Gerald, for this. Um, but he s commented on one of my videos. Why don't you use the Jenny motion to emulate the Android instead? Um, it's much faster. Well, yeah, I actually did try it out. I kind of looked it up um, just to see how it goes, and we actually have uh, one running. I'll put the link in the description, but if you go to um, JennyMotion.com, uh, you can just go to the website, and they'll you have to sign up and stuff. It's not really it's not that big of a deal, um, but all in all, when you when you finish it, you have um, this cute little screen called uh, Jenny Motion for personal use. Uh, you're not going to have like a Nexus 7 uh, API. You're going to have to add one. And you're going to have to sign in, um, and if you connect and you give your username and password, um, then you can like pick from a list. So then you can start it up, and um, it takes a little while to do it at first, but ultimately it, it is so much faster than um, the emulator that comes with Eclipse and Android. And we can kind of like already tell um, this took like 10 minutes to start up and honestly that actually was this is actually faster than it was before it usually takes so long but now it's already set like this is it took literally a split second to set up uh, and it's so much more responsive and stuff like that so again just trying to throw these tips at you guys so that you can um, better uh, develop more efficiently and stuff like that so um, with that being said thank you so much for watching that's all I really have thank you so much to uh, Gerald and Havard, I'm sorry if I botched that. Um, but thank you so much for you guys. Um, just trying to spread the word on what your fellow subscribers are doing. Um, and if you have any more tips, please hit me up. Hit hit up the comment section because we're all learning together. Uh, and we're all just trying to um, develop and make millions of dollars like every other person in the world. So thank you so much for watching. Uh, please rate, subscribe, comment. And I will see you guys later.